Since Dickerson is in the zone, let's go ahead and keep on using him until he is out of it. So right here, I'm literally going to go with a halfback dive and we should be able to... Oh my god! We should be able to get this touchdown! Woo! Hold on now! The intro song today. You guys do this on purpose? You guys want me to drop a freestyle to this? You're so special. You're so special. You're so special. You're so special. Hold up. This is like a love song right here. Um, uh, Young Toe. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. She left me on red. Yeah, she left me on red. All right, we got to stop. We got to stop. What are we doing? My guys, we are back, man. We are back with a brand new Madden 20 Ultimate Team episode. I hope you guys are all having an amazing day. Let's get right into this. You know how we like to start off these episodes by taking a look at not only our offense. You know, we made a lot of changes last episode. Today, I don't think you guys are ready. I don't think you guys are ready for today's moves. But here, you get to see the defense. Some of these players, I did change their picture. But yeah, these are the same players from the end of the last episode before we do anything let's try to reach 6,000 likes on this episode it would truly mean a lot the more you guys like it the more youtube will push it out to other people also subscribe to the channel if you haven't so a few days ago they did drop theme builders and the last episode we covered some of these players now this past weekend they dropped a bunch of new ultimate legends the first one which is the limited they dropped this andre reed 97 overall not bad i feel like right now there's just too many cards coming out there's also this brand new eric dickerson which i have no idea why it's throwing the football in the picture but we're not gonna get too technical okay this isn't a bad card either last but not least the final the third ultimate legend card that came out this weekend is this rod woodson now you know i'm about to shred not one but those we're about to get two of these ultimate legend bundles in total we got 12 ultimate legend packs two bundle toppers we're gonna do the bundle toppers at the end i mean you guys know how this works my goal is to get at least one i mean i feel like that's everyone's goal like when you buy a bundle you kind of do deserve one full legend especially like seeing the cost of some of these they don't even go for that much so here we go boys let's see if we can get it done here yes sir yes sir oh it's a 90 whoa okay we get our boy rigo berto you know what we're gonna make our first move of the day look i'm gonna pick both of these guys up my punter is the best punter in the game but look i'm gonna take him out and guess who's gonna be our starter now Ladies and gentlemen, welcome that boy, Rigo Berto. He's officially our starting punter. All right, back to the packs we go. We still got a long way. The funny thing is about that punter is someone actually commented on the last episode because we pulled him on the last episode as well. And someone commented and said that Rigo Berto, the punter, went to their high school. So that's pretty dope. Like, what a small world. Come on now. Full X, full X. Let's go. See, that is all. Because of that boy, Rigoberto. You see the luck that he brought? You see what he just did? We get a full legend, Walter Jones. I'm going to pick him up and I'm going to pick up Calvin. By the way, I did forget to mention. So, if you guys forgot, a couple of weeks ago, I went to the Super Bowl uh, in Miami. And I made a vlog out of it and whatnot. You guys remember, like, I uploaded a video on it. And if you guys did miss it, it will be down in the description. Now, something cool that happened was, I don't know if you guys saw, I did make a video with Russell Wilson. Now, here's the thing. When I was filming with him, oh wow, we get a 94. When I was filming with Russell, he also had like a camera crew with him and they were filming him as well because apparently he has a YouTube channel. So yeah, he does have a YouTube channel and the crazy thing is he dropped his perspective, like he dropped his own vlog featuring me. Like I was on a thumbnail, bro, it's crazy. Like you guys need to go check it out. I can't believe that. Like Russell Wilson uploaded me to his channel like isn't that crazy and honestly like it wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for your support honestly like i'll keep it real with you guys it wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for your support my boys we are down to the bundle toppers 292 pluses let's not waste any time let's see if we could clutch out another full legend come on baby i know we can do it i know we can do it that's a full legend we get calvin i got confused because i was like wait isn't calvin a 97 but no he's a 96 Full legend Calvin, that's amazing. Let's see how we are closing this one out. I don't think we're gonna top the previous pack, but we'll see. We can do two full legends? That'll be even better. 
We can't clutch out too, but I will take it a successful pack opening for us today. We're officially done opening up packs. Now it is time to make some upgrades to this team. Now, well, first things first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and release Nick Chubb and bump down Marcus Allen and Saquon one spot. So as you guys see, Marcus Allen and Saquon got bumped down one spot. We have an opening at the starting position. And we got a comment from Royce. He said, get the new Eric Dickerson because he's a beast. Eric Dickerson, the cheapest one up right now, is going for 480,000 coins. And there you have it. He has now become our brand new running back. And for those curious, here is what his stats look like. This card is going to be unreal. Next up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to release my left guard, center, and right guard. And the reason why I did that is because we got a comment from Blitz. He said, new left guard, center, and right guard. They have been there for a while. Love the videos. Keep up the good work. So yeah, he told me to get new right guard, center, and left guard. So that's what we're going to go out there and do right now. For the left guard spot, I will be getting Quinton Nelson. Our brand new center is going to be Alex Mack. And our brand new right guard is going to be no other than Brandon Sheriff. And there you guys have it. Our offensive line has improved. If we don't rush for like 500 yards on our next game with this offensive line, then I have to be absolutely ridiculously tremendously trash moving on over to the defense side of things we are going to be releasing von miller there's a position that a lot of you have been asking for improvement so today i got you our brand new left outside linebacker i'm actually excited to use this card because i feel like we've had von miller for like a long time so this is gonna be a nice little change to our team and there you guys have it tj watt is officially our starter next up another surprising move i will be releasing lawrence taylor i wanted to do this to show you guys that i am reading the comment section because honestly lawrence taylor has been there for like ages we got a comment from joseph he said get fred warner because he is a beast when i got rid of lawrence taylor i did a lot of research because it's gonna be a huge shoe to fill to replace lawrence but this card here I did a lot of research, like I said, and this card really stood out to me. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy them. And there you guys have it. That is the final move of the day. If there's any other changes we should make for the next episode, comment down below and let your boy know and you could be featured on it. But yeah, you guys see the defense. Let's flip on over to the offense. Like I said, this is the only moves that we are making today. It is time to play our first game online. We have three more wins until we make it back to the playoffs. All right, let's go ahead and get into this game. Now, the only thing that I'm thinking about right now is will his X Factor, will Eric Dickerson's X Factor be turned on? We get to see his first possession of the day. Now, we are both wearing Rams uniforms. He's wearing the white jerseys and then I'm wearing the other jerseys and he is up on offense first. The first start down of the day, he only needs a yard. Oh, I'm very shocked he didn't just run the ball and his receiver dropped it. So now the question is, is he gonna go for it? This man, Juju Smith, heard some footsteps. All right, here we go. He is going for it and I'm 100% certain he's gonna run. No, he's not. He's not wide open Juju again, okay. We have to lock in. So far today, this dude has been like shredding us. Like, I have to keep it real with you. He's faced with a first and 10 at the 16 yard line. I bring the blitz and we do bring down Kyler Murray for the sack. And that was Warner, the guy that we just got. What in the world? He went with a fake spike. And it is Pat Tillman getting the sack and a fumble in the recovery. Biggest question of the day does Eric Dickerson have his x factor lit up he does oh we gotta snap it we gotta snap it can we go for a touchdown on the first play oh my oh wow i wanted to take that to the house we're faced with a third and 11 here let's target the outsides right there bang first down going to eric dickerson we need some big yards oh my eric dickerson we're getting closer and closer we're gonna break one to the house trust me trust me oh my there he goes. I want to sit farm someone. I want to. Oh. Oh. Oh, I couldn't sit farm anyone. Dude, they're like running into each other behind me. Eric Dickerson, the first touchdown of the day, man. Let's go. The thing is, I don't know if I should have like Fred Warner playing coverage or like sending blitzes. Like, I don't know how I should use them. But right here, we get a pick with Taylor. Oh, no. Oh, I. I almost celebrated way too early. Taylor Mays with the pick six. We can't ask for a better start here. All the way at the 39 yard line now. Let's see what he does. 
Kyler's gonna take off. Oh, he's about to get lit up. He's about to get lit up. Give me that. Give me that. Ooh. Ooh, big boy Warren Sapp. Oh, look at this. He is bringing everyone. We're gonna try this pitch to the left side. Oh, we got it. We got it. Big first down. My favorite play in the game. We're gonna try out the Wildcat. Second and 14 here. We're controlling this game. We even get the ball back to start the second half. Oh my God. Yo, two stiff arms. Right back to Dickerson. Right back to Dickerson. With the goggles too. I've been sending Warner on a blitz, but now I'm gonna try like usering with him. We'll see what we can do. I don't know how this dude is so brave right now. Like, test of my secondary. Big third down. I'm there. I'm there. I'm there. Bring him down. Julius Peppers. His first sack of the day. And that was just a basic cover three. You know, I'm not bringing any crazy or glitchy blitzes. You guys see right now, this could be the game decider. Is that even a word? But this could end the game right here. With that sack, TJ Watt. Our new addition. Is our opponent going to stick around? It looks like for now he is. So we got three timeouts. 38 seconds. We should be able to go in. We should be able to go in. Oh my god. One more. Oh, we couldn't get one more stiff arm. But Eric Dickerson just got his like, what? Third? Or that might be a second touchdown. Coming back out here to start off the second half once again. We're going to see if he's wide awake. Going with this screen play. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Dude, this card feels amazing. Let's see if we could try to target Waller here. Oh my, no way, no way. Oh my God, our tight end. We are officially in the fourth quarter. Here we go. Time to feed the man. Time to feed Dickerson. Oh, one more. Oh no, I should have just went in for the touchdown. I got greedy. I wanted one more step bar. Look at this dude's formation on fourth and goal. Come on. Come on. Dickerson. And he went under the ground. Did you see that? Three rushing. One receiving touchdown. Eric Dickerson has done it all today. First game of the day has come to an end. I think for sure we got to jump into another game. But you guys see 20 carries, 180 yards, three rushing touchdowns. And you guys also saw a receiving touchdown from Eric Dickerson. Yeah, this was a dominating performance. We won 42 to nothing. Yeah, there goes his stats rushing wise, receiving wise, three catches, 30 yards, and a touchdown. And then Darren Waller had that big 50-yard catch as well. Two more wins now, and we'll be in the playoffs. So let's go ahead and jump into our second game. We're jumping into the second game. Honestly, I am just that much more confident now to make a Super Bowl run, especially with Eric Dickerson on our team. I'm not gonna lie, his top three look crazy. Let's see what he does here on his first possession. Okay, he's going with a run here, and we are all over it. TJ Watt there with the tackle, which brings up this third and five. We need to stop that. He's going back to the run, and we are all over it. Warner with the tackle, and now, now my boys, he's going for it. He's going for it. No, sir. No, sir. Since Dickerson is in the zone, let's go ahead and keep on using him until he is out of it. So right here, I'm literally going to go with a halfback dive and we should be able to. Oh, my God. We should be able to get this touchdown. Bring out the red carpet. Keep in mind, this dude's team is amazing. I saw his top three players and Eric Dickerson is literally out here stiff farming everyone that is in his way. His second possession of the day now. Let's see how this one here is about to go. He goes to the run. He goes to the run. Okay, we have to contain Dickerson. Huge third down here and he goes back to the run. He really got the ball back? This is it right here. Let's see what he does. No way. No way. No way. I knew he was going there. I knew he was. What the? What happened? Okay. I'll take it. That's better than a pick. An incompletion is better than a pick. We're at the 29. Like, at this point, I don't even mind taking a field goal. But Dickerson. Oh, he's tired. Wait, what happened to his energy? That was just trippy because that should have been a touchdown. But he was just out of breath. Like, right off the gate. But it doesn't matter because we still end things off with an Eric Dickerson touchdown here. He's just dominating this episode. His next possession comes at about like the three minute mark. 
Ooh, beautiful throw. Beautiful throw. Third and goal now. Yo, I need this. I Come on. I said I needed this. We're starting the second half. You guys see we do have the ball here first. The score is 14 to 7. So honestly, this is a big possession right here. Like if we could score, we should have control of the game. And I know I'm up here, but it just feels like the momentum is like on his side. That's why I'm just like very hungry to score here. We go to Dickerson and he's going to be short. Hopefully we can secure the first down here. Wait a second. Wait a second. Right there. Go Tyreek. Go Tyreek. Is he going to be short? A much needed first down. Let's just try to get into field goal territory. Take one. Even though he got benched. He's still making an impact. Unreal. If we could get a stop in this possession, I think. I think. Hold up, man. Let me not even. Oh, my Lord. Never mind. I was going to say, if we get a stop, this should be over. But never mind. Third and 12. Man, oh, man. We have to try to convert here. We ha Oh, God. I didn't even see him. So, now we got to punt the ball and just pray our defense could get a stop. Here we go. The biggest possession of the day boys let's see what's gonna happen let's see what's how was he that open i'm playing cover four they said get nitrate lane he can stop anybody i'm just so confused and disgusted at this point i really am and look at this why did i why did i throw that i have no words i truly don't have any words right now Look at this dude. Look at mother. I'm legit disgusted. I'm legit disgusted right now. Give me that. Give me that. Let's go. Quentin Dunbar. You see me using with him? We needed this. We really needed this. I can't even celebrate early. Like, I can't even celebrate early. Here we go, man. This is officially it. We need to stop bad. Let's see what our defense could do. Second and six. Come on. No way. Dude, he's dotting me up. I need to stop so bad. Like, my confidence right now is so low. You don't even understand. You don't even understand. I'm going to need you guys just to pray for me. Lord, I need you. I need you bad. How does he hang on to that? I cannot have this dude score. No. No. Did we get it? Did he give it to us? They gave it to us! Nitray Lane! I was talking trash about him earlier. I was talking trash about him. Victory formation, boys. That was an incredible game. King down to the wire. Your boy was super nervous. But as you guys see, man, we are going to walk away victorious. Let's go, baby. What an incredible game. Quentin Dunbar, the player of the game. You guys saw the pick six he had to give us the lead right back. And just like that, we are now one win away from going back to the playoffs so i'll see you guys on the next episode as we try to make that run there you guys have a boss nation i hope you enjoyed this episode if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel if you're new i'm gonna see you guys on the next one i'm signing out <laughs>